Okay, this is the spirometer. So this is what we will be using for some of the respiratory physiology experiments. For tidal volume, that is the amount of air that's exhaled or inhaled just during normal breathing. So I've just been breathing normally. And what I'm going to do is just blow into this. As you can see, I did not do any exaggerated hard exhaling. And then we'll just measure the number, which was not real high, about 500. This is the expiratory reserve volume. We're measuring the amount of air that can be forcibly blown out after you have exhaled normally. So I'm going to be breathing normally, exhale, and then I'm going to forcibly try to blow out or exhale the rest of the remaining air. So here we go. Notice I went to a 90 degree angle to try to force out as much as possible. So the expiratory reserve volume on this one looks to be about 1300. Okay, these next measurement is going to be the vital capacity. That is the amount of air that I can forcibly exhale after I have done a maximum inhalation. So I'm going to breathe in deeply several times, then take a deep breath and see how much I can blow out as forcibly as possible. The amount is 2300. This will be the IRV, the inspiratory reserve volume. I'm going to be breathing deeply, taking a deep breath, but then exhale normally without forcing it out. The number is about 500.